It almost seems like since it's allowing me to go anywhere, that I have to catch the Pokemon myself. But how would I do that? The only character that has to do with Pokemon is Sprig. Oh yeah, that's right, I gotta use the phone. I cannot use the phone here. Can I use the phone on the world map? Yes, I can. Can I look at what he can transform into? Probably not. No. I wish he had like a menu that could tell me like... Well, I guess if the, if the Pokemon that he can turn into look similar to the ones that I get in the arena, then maybe... Maybe that's how it works, but that's really silly. That does, like, nothing to do with... Like, Sprig's not even there at the tournament. That would be a really stupid... Oh, yeah, right. This is not a normal RPG. I have to go walk into stuff. This... Is there even fights here? I've never been here before. A gigantic monster moved in. It took away my star fragment. Is that an enemy or just a a gloop walking around? <laughs> I guess it's just a gloop walking around. All right, you know. Do you guys sell pokeballs here? That's the real question. What in God's name? What's that? What is that? I don't know. It's a good question. It's empty. Alright. That was interesting. Uh, not seeming like there's much to do here. At least not yet. I gotta go find Professor Oak and learn how Pokeballs work. Has something to do with my giant forehead. For sure. Alright, well let's go somewhere with fights. So I can see... You know... Should have fights, right? Uh, maybe not actually. Isn't this just a. Oh no, this... what is that? That looks magical. Do, 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 do. Okay, that's a fight. Ba -ba -ba. Okay. Go, Sprig! Smack him up! to the bits, Aaron. Ha! <laughs> uh, figured it out. This is definitely the list. Man, that is... I gotta be honest. That's really stupid. I mean, they might have told me, but I totally missed it. 
I mean, it, it, I'll, I'll probably... I'm going to go back and look and see if they told me and I just missed it. But either way, like, this is really dumb for me. Like, I don't understand how... Like, in my brain, this makes no sense. Maybe you guys disagree with me. But for me, this makes no sense. First of all, Sprig wasn't even in our party. And it's not like when we go into the tournament, Sprig comes out and he's like, Hey, I'll help. And then the battle is between, like, three Pokemon. And Sprig is only, like, one guy. So, like, it... How would that be... You know what I mean? Like... This is the last thing I would have thought of. And it was the last thing I thought of. <laughs> you know? So how do I unlock more? Do I just kill him? Do I have to kill him with another Pokemon? Does he have like an ability that captures them? I mean, I don't think so. I think you just kill stuff. <clears throat> Do I have to kill him with Sprig, though? Possibly. But yeah, like, the, do you guys agree with me or not? Like, what do, you, do you think, is it, would you have thought of this? Or those of you that have played the game, did you think of this, like, right away? Or did you get stuck here, too? Because to me, like, that makes no sense. If Sprig had come out and said, like, hey, I'll help you guys out, we can use my Pokemon, then, like, yeah, it would make sense, but it... Sprig wasn't even in my party, and there were three Pokemon instead of one in each battle, so uh, Sprig didn't even, like, go through my mind. I forgot Norris gets a gun. They tell you when you first get Sprig. Well, I, I think they tell you how to get the Pokemon. But they don't tell you that they they fight in the tournament, do they? I think a lot of people probably, if they used Sprig more than I did, then they probably would have noticed that the lists were the same. I didn't because I didn't use Sprig very long, so that's my fault, you know? But, uh, yeah, I don't know, that just didn't go through my head. I'm glad we figured it out, though. It's, it's funny that I did actually come somewhat close to beating the, the fight with the regular enemies, though. Yo, Chemical! How's it going, man? We just figured out Blue's Clues. <laughs> that little dodge animation is hilarious. Alright, so I killed two with Sprig, so hopefully I get those two. I can't even check until I get into another fight, though. I got Inferno? That sounds useful. Whoa! What in the world just happened there? Oh. Okay. I don't know. I, can they level up? Who knows? I have zero idea how it works.
These guys should be strong. So I did not unlock those two guys. So... How does this work? <laughs> trying to heal the enemy. Huh? Heal... Heal Norris. Yeah, maybe I have to kill him with, with Sprig alone, which sounds really hard. At least I get an idea of when they're almost dead, though. They, like, do that animation. Holy crap, Lynx. You want to not one-shot things? I'm trying to capture Pokemon here. Show me the Pokemon. Is he hurt? Camera? Well, at least Sprig does okay damage. He doesn't do like four damage. What the? Did he just... Wow, you killed... Why did he do that? Why did Norris just counter with that? What happened? You screwed up my thing. Oh, he's like berserked or something, that's why. He's just doing his own thing over there. Well, great. Good time to be berserked. The one time I'm trying to carefully kill something. God dang it, Norris! Unbelievable. Oh, he didn't kill. Oh, he attacked Sprig! Okay. <laughs> God dang it, Sprig. Kill Norris. That's not Norris. That's the one person I didn't want you to kill. I tell you what, this game is being real nice to me today. Like, just so nice to me today. Anything that could go wrong has gone wrong. Okay, I killed him with Sprig. Did anything happen? Maybe. Perhaps. Who knows? What the?
Alright, Sprig. Wait, I got Will of the Wisp? I got them both. But I didn't kill Will o' Wisp with Sprig. <laughs> I guess maybe you just have to kill the enemies and Sprig just needs to be not transformed. I have everyone in this fight, so... Hey, how's it going, Jimbo? Okay, so... Um... That honestly, like, is already almost enough. Like, I just needed something else, you know? Now that I have that... Now that I have these two guys, especially Airframe, because Airframe should be pretty strong, I'm probably going to be okay, but let, let's see if we can get anyone else. Yeah, I have an equipment on Sprig that gives her more max HP than... She gives her more HP than her max HP when starting the fight. So that's why she has more than her max HP until now. Get a dodo. Yeah, those guys were strong. That could be a good good plan. I choose you, Lynx. Deck out Sprig with your best equipment. You think that'll affect the Pokemon? Maybe. I really, you know, it, it depends on how that whole Pokemon tournament works. Like, I don't know if it's technically Sprig that's in the tournament because there's three of them. But maybe they just copy and paste three Sprigs for that tournament and, like, take his stats, her stats. In that case, just leveling up Sprig would help us win, also. I'm honestly wondering if there's something here, because... Sprig stats don't matter. Okay. See, that's kind of what I figured, because... There's three of them, so it doesn't make much sense. I think everyone here. Well, actually, there's that those little dudes that I could get. They don't seem that strong, but unfortunately, I'm not getting any other fights. Yeah, I don't want that much help, Sasha, but thank you. I appreciate it.
I don't believe you have to get the killing blow. Because I didn't against the one guy, and I still got him. <laughs> like, uh, maybe that was a glitch or something, but... You can go back and watch. I did not get the killing blow. I kill. I got him down to almost dead. And then... Um, uh, what's his name? Norris got... Was berserked and killed him. With Graviton. And I still got him somehow. It's weird. Unless... No, because I checked. I checked when I got the killing blow before and it didn't work. Yeah, that was weird. I don't know why that happened. Maybe like maybe there's a glitch where like if Sprig gets the last hit and then a berserked and a berserked party member kills him, then you like still get him. Okay, where else would there be strong enemies? Uh, Water Dragon Isle. I remember the enemies there being that strong. We usually we fought mostly like goblins. Goblins. Oh, the enemies here are really strong. Cause like I'm not even supposed to go here yet. I could try here. So, if you guys remember last time, I came over here thinking that I was supposed to go this way. And I got, like, obliterated. <laughs> See you later. I'm like, oh crap, we tried to warn him. <laughs> hey, what's up, Suna? Oh, hey, I meant to message you this morning. If you have the latest build of, uh, Scavenger... Send it over whenever. And I'll use it when we beta test later. Okay, so these guys are like... Really strong. But I, I'm only fighting one, so I might be alright. How long till testing? Uh, two and a half hours ish. I'd say three hours. He's electric, so this might not do a lot of damage, but. This attack is so weird. Getting getting the final hit with uh, Sprig is going to be something. Okay, he's almost dead. Can't I attack, like, the bomb or something? Or, like, if I attack, the bomb moves or something? Whatever. I don't care if he gets blown up. Yeah! Oh god, I'm still fighting the bomb. What if I could unlock the bomb? That would be sweet. Wow, nice misses. That was magical. How much health does this thing have? <laughs> you, ever, you ever have a bomb at your foot and you just try to shoot it? Doesn't seem like a good, good strategy. 
Yeah, not not the best strategy to be honest. Hate to see it. Alright, well I should have unlocked that guy. He should be like real strong, I hope. <coughs> May I see your team's equipment? I have uh, all the strong stuff on links. All the Dragoon stuff on links. And then... Uh, just kind of crappy stuff on everyone else. I have a bunch of magic stuff on Sprig. But that's kind of useless because I'm not using magic with him, so... I could probably unequip this stuff. Because I don't really use Sprig other than just trying to get Pokemon right now. I also need to upgrade my weapons, because like I still have like copper weapons, but I haven't really figured out how to do that yet. There's those guys that like let you upgrade equipment, but I haven't been able to. What's up, Patch? Okay, well I don't really need to fight more of these guys. I think this gets me out, right? Or no. Yeah, it does. There's probably someone else I could get down there that would be useful, but... You guys alright? I thought you were goners for sure. We're fine. So the quicksand is the entrance and the sand boil is the exit. Now why couldn't I figure that out? So there was something blocking a pathway, you say? Okay, let us take care of it. It may take some time, though. Let's see now. I need to assign some men to investigate and prepare explosives to move that rock. Would you mind coming back in a little while? We have some preparations to do, but thanks a lot for your help. Yeah, no problem. We'll come back when the plot says we have to come here. Because that's what heroes do. Your hero knows when to plot. <laughs> what about here? This had strong enemies, right? It has strong music. So we got that going for us. This guy's got to be strong, right? Ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba. Yeah, I was about to say, I could go back and get that chest that I accidentally froze last time. Lava boy. Yep, I'll catch you later, Jimbo. You have a safe trip, alright, man? Keep me updated. takes no damage. Okay, Zell. What's this do? Oh yeah.
Persian. Use Bubble Beam. Get him, Sprig. Beat him up. Uh. Wow. That one damage, though. Should have given Sprig like all the Dragoon stuff just for this. But I mean, it's not that bad. Especially since this guy doesn't do much damage to us. I can just keep defending. But yeah, that's probably the good strat is to just give him all that Dragoon equipment. Boom! Big sprig damage. It is kind of annoying that there isn't like a message that pops up that says like, you caught Lava Boy. You know what I mean? Like you would think that would be a thing. I might capture one of these guys. No, I don't believe you can. There's Cat Burglar. I already got him. I still can't believe they're called Hot Diggities. How's it going, Bryant? I feel like Lava Boy is going to be really strong. I feel like that's probably all we're going to need. You know what, why not? Hopefully I don't kill them all. I want a hot diggity just for the, the bragging rights, you know? <laughs> Their face cracks me up. They're so funny looking. Look at their face, dude. They look so ridiculous. How do the catching mechanics work? Your guess is as good as mine. I believe getting the final hit with Sprig when he's not transformed is how you get how you capture Pokemon and I th they probably said something about that when I first met Sprig but I kind of decided I wasn't going to use her so I didn't pay as much attention I didn't think it was going to be like vital to our continuation of the game so <laughs> they might have said something about it they certainly didn't say like hey you're going to have to use this for a Pokemon tournament later but okay so we got we got Fossaker wait a second I didn't get I didn't get Lava Boy why not Are you telling me that it's like... That you don't always get them? If it's luck based, then that's stupid. Because it doesn't tell you when you get them. And there's no way to check. This is stupid. 
Like, I really don't like this. The fact that I can't check in the menu, and the fact that it doesn't always work. Like, could they have made this any more... annoying? There had to have been a better way. If you're gonna make it only work on some enemies, then there should be some kind of indication that I can catch something. And if you're gonna make it luck based, then there should be some indication when it works. And that I should be able to check in the menu. Yeah, I don't, I don't like this at all. Like, it's a cool mechanic, but... Definitely annoying. I don't understand why they couldn't have made this like easier to understand. Like, can I check right now and see if I got him? I did. I already, I got hot diggity. So like, what the heck? Come on, Mr. Forehead. Use your brain. <laughs> Figure out how this works. No, it definitely can be the last enemy to die, because that's how I got Bone Frame. Or whatever his name, Air Frame. Now this guy would be mega awesome to get. Because he's super mega strong in the friggin' tournament. Lindary. He's super mega strong out of the tournament too. This big jerk. Norris, why are you so weak? You suck. What a hot diggity. Yo, works, dog. Thank you so much for the five months. Appreciate it, my man. Welcome back to the crew. Good to see you this morning, dude. One more month till that Buster Sword badge. Stop missing! <laughs> Now's not the time. Rip Norris. Spray, yeah, I do more damage than that. I can't heal you because I don't want to attack with Lynx. Oh no, don't hit Sprague. Ah, monkeys. I can revive you, but I don't have enough to heal you. I, oh wait, Sprig has heal, I forgot. Let me do this. Oh 
<laughs> he had seven health left. Smack. Alright, let's hope we got him. I did not. I did not mean to do that. There we go. Yo, Warks, thank you for the thousand bits! Skelly almost looked like Sprig's skeleton transformation. Maybe that was the plan all along. Do you have a heal? like Norris much. His gun kind of blows. And he's not like super good with magic either. Whoa! We got PDX with the $50! Holy cow! Thank you, thank you so much! Holy crap! Wasn't expecting that early in the morning. Appreciate it, my man. Hey Death, due to my job I rarely get to catch the live streams, but I have enjoyed the hundreds of hours of YouTube comment. You have a great attitude and amazing community. I'll continue to support whenever I can. Man, that means so much to me, dude. Thank you so much. This show is uh, not possible without people like you. It's almost completely supported by fans like yourself, so I appreciate that so much. Okay, we got Terminator, so... Thank you, thank you so much for the support, man. All the, all the <laughs> names in this game are great. I mean, nothing beats Hot Diggity, but... Terminator is pretty good, too. <laughs> Alright. Without a doubt, with the Fossaker, the Terminator. And, well, we don't have Lava Boy. Now I'll go back and try to get Lava Boy again, but, uh... Fossaker and Terminator, and, uh, the Bone... The Bone Guy. That should be more than enough to, uh... To get us there. Was, it, was the chest in this area? It wasn't, I don't think. I think it was in the next area. But I, I kind of want to get out of here, because... Well, first of all, we're, like, dead, so that's not good. Hate to see it. Lava boy. No, this ain't the spot. I don't think. There are two chests in here, though. Yo, Anonymous with a gifted sub to Chemical for the nine months. Welcome back, my man. For the ninth month. It is? I don't see it. I don't see a chest. I thought it looked right, but I, I don't see a chest. Unless it's up here. No. Definitely not the spot. 
Yo, Lord Stog with the five gifted subs. Thank you so much, my man. We got Rolling Cow, we got Chipper Monkey, we got Lexicon, we got Mark, and we got Game Man. Welcome to the crew, everybody. Give us some nice music to listen to while we fight Lava Boy again. Holy cow, we got a gifted sub train going on right now. Everyone's getting subs. Oops, Flash with a gifted sub to Mavic. Welcome to the crew, Mavic. You guys are the best. Big Choo Choo. In there, Sprig. How deep are we into Chrono? Um, I don't know, really. <laughs> I, I don't really know. Maybe someone could PM you and let you know how far we are. But I'm not. I'm not sure. Hard to tell. There have been parts that I've kind of blazed through, and then other parts that I've gotten stuck on forever. Like, uh, this part. So, hard to tell. Another anonymous gifted sub to PDX. PDX, welcome to the crew, man. Enjoy those emotes and that beautiful badge. If we got Lava Boy, but I definitely killed him with Sprig, so. I guess we'll see. Yeah, I have a feeling that, like, that chest disappeared and now, like, these chests are here instead. Well, I just walked around there. <laughs> wow, nice, nice, uh, guard duty you're doing there, buddy. Good attempt. He gave it his all. This guy's looking tired. I'll leave him alone. He had a rough day. What if I just freeze this guy in the ice? Oh, that's a hot diggity. Didn't really look like a hot diggity. It's just a, si a single hot diggity? Or hot, hot doggity, sorry. Let me make sure I get his name right. It's the best name in the game. Better, better get it right. Ow, jeez. Uh, so we played through uh, we played through Xenogears a long time ago. Played about ten-ish hours of it, and uh, I'd love to return to it sometime and finish it. Maybe do a full let's play of it. It's it'll probably be a full let's play at some point. I would have to think after we're done with this and a couple other games we want to do. 
I would be down to do Zeno Gears as a full YouTube series. It was a lot of fun. I really liked Zeno Gears. And what's funny is I didn't really think I would, because usually I don't really like uh, like mech builder games, you know? I guess they're just not really my my thing. But uh, I, I really enjoyed it a lot. It was fun. Alright, we're out of here. I have no idea if I have Lava Boy, but... I think, I think we got what we need. I think we got the tools necessary 